Hi, how you doing? Michelle Zemba here. Time to Tai Chi with me. Let's start right in the middle. Feet about shoulder width apart. Nice and loosey goosey. We're gonna scoop from the floor. We're gonna interlock our fingers. We're gonna raise our hands high above our head. That first early morning stretch. Then my palms turn face down and I'm gonna sink through the floor. I'm gonna scoop again here at the bottom. Nice inhale up. Stretch tall above the head. And then relax, palms down. Sink down through the floor. Little sinking in my knees. How about one more time? Nice inhale up. Stretch nice and tall. Palms turn face down. Let go all of the thoughts from the day. Good job. I'm gonna interlock my fingers. I'm gonna bring my hands up over my head. I'm gonna do a nice little C stretch each side. How far am I going? just until I feel my muscles start to stretch and then I relax. How about a nice twist? Each side. This is how we get our energy moving, the fluid in our body and through our spine moving. Palms down, sink through the floor. Scoop, interlock. Nice lift over the head, a C stretch to each side, only as far as the muscles will start to go and then let you feel that they're starting to stretch. That's when I start to release, come back into that center. How about a little twist each side? Nice and slow today. Bringing that nice soothing energy up from the ground, right? Scoop, soothing energy, scooping up, and then opening each side of the spine. And then how about ringing the spine, a little twist each side. Good job, palms face the floor down to the floor. Good job. How about a little shake it out here? And my hands are gonna come together, maybe about a couple inches apart, and I'm gonna swing my arms. This is from a fragrance Chi Kung set that I learned a long time ago. This is called eights. This swings the arms, opens up the shoulders, moves the shoulder blades around. We're gonna be doing a little arm work today. And then back into the center. And then how about hand over hand, right? Palms up, palms down, doesn't matter. How about swinging the arms side to side? Right, like rock the baby. This opens up the shoulder side to side, moves the shoulder blades on the back. Good job, good job. I can feel the energy flowing up through my chest already. Let's come back down into the center. And how about some hip circles? Nice big opening hip circles, round and round. See if there's an area that feels tighter, one side more than the other. And then how about, let's switch direction for those hip circles. Good job. Let's come back into the center here, hand over hand. My top hand is gonna keep the torso above nice and still. My bottom hand is gonna help 
my lower pelvic bowl, right, my pelvic girdle do little circles. So it's just the last few vertebrae of my back that I'm trying to make little circles with. Right, really cultivating some energy, drawing the energy down into the lower dantian. Plus, you know, summer's coming. We gotta start working on the hips and waist anyways. I do. Back into the center. Let's go the other direction. Little small pelvic circles. Good job, good job, good job. Let's come back into the center. We're gonna warm up these hips a little more. I'm gonna keep my hands out by my side, palms up. Sometimes I'll extend them out further. Otherwise, I'm going to keep them kind of close. I'm going to take my knee from the inside of the body out. Nice little hip circle here. Well, a leg circle, really, too. Three. Let's do four, five, six. Let's do six. So I think that was four. Ready? Five and six. Good. How about from the outside in? Oh, these are always so tough. This is five and six, last one. Excellent, how about the other side? Inside out goes that knee. Two, keep your grounded leg, keep that knee nice and soft. This is five, one more. How about outside in? Ooh, tough, two, let's do six together. Three, come on, four, sitting around so much. Five, I deserve it, right? Six, last one, Whew. awesome job. Shake it off, shake it off, shake it off, shake it off, shake it off. Excellent, from the middle here. We're gonna take a nice deep breath up, hands come up high overhead. Let the hands turn palms down and sink through the floor. My hands are gonna rise along my side about shoulder height. I'm gonna bring them into the center. I'm gonna turn my palms over and sink, sinking my chi. Nice inhale up into the center. Turn your hands over and sink down into the floor. Great job. Last time. Then my hands are gonna float straight up to shoulder height. Nice inhale up and then let them sink down. Nice inhale, the hands rise. This is called opening the door. And then let them sink down. One more time. Nice inhale, they rise. Opening the door or opening the gate. And sink. Here my hands are going to float out to my side. I'm going to embrace a moon, this hand on top, catching a ball. Hands are gonna come out to my sides again. The other hand on top. Good job. Expanding through the chest. Other hand on top. Embracing the moon. Last time right here. Good job. Now my hands are gonna come out to my sides. I'm gonna come into the center here and catch a ball in the middle. And I'm gonna bring that ball close to my chest. And I'm gonna bring my feet just a little bit further than uh, hip width apart. And then I'm gonna dig straight down into the ground. And then I'm gonna lift my hands high up over my head and then dig straight down through the ground. Excellent for grounding, rooting, finding your center. Exhale, push down, inhale, Reach up high above the head. Exhale down. Inhale up. And exhale down. 
two more times. Last time. Good job. Palms face down towards the floor. I'm going to heel toe my feet closer together. And then my hands are going to come just about uh, waist level palms up. Now this hand here on this side is going to push out towards the TV, towards you. And then turn palms up and slice across the rest of the room. So I'm gonna turn my torso and then return back into the ribs. Let's try that again. So this hand here pushes out, turns palms up, slices through the rest of the horizon and returns back into the ribs. Pushes out, slices, returns back into the ribs. A nice slice, ooh, push, ooh, push first, slice second, back into the ribs. One more time. And slice and return. Now let's try that with the other hand. Push, palm up, turn towards the corner, hand returns back into the ribs. Nice push. Palm up, return back into the ribs. Push forward, slice, palm up, return back into the ribs. Let's do that two more times. And then we're gonna do both hands together. So here we push, slice, back into the ribs. So this hand will push, slice, and as it's returning back into the rib is when your other hand starts its push, slice. And upon that return, the other hand push, slice. Not that hard, huh? Push. So you have a nice twisting in the torso. This twists the body all the way through the shoulders, all the way through the torso, down into the hips and the legs. Squeezing out toxins, bringing in good health, good vitality. Excellent job. Slice, push, slice, push. Excellent last time. Slice. Both hands return back into the ribs. Excellent job. Bring your hands high up overhead today. Sink down through the floor. Nice inhale up. Washing our chi feeling renewed for the day, feeling strong for today. And this last time, hands will rise up overhead. They're gonna float down towards the floor. And once they get about waist high, they're gonna bounce from the floor, boing. I'm gonna trace the big Buddha belly, ha 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 ha. The bigger your belly, the more you laugh, the happier and healthier you are. I'm going to lift up into the chest. Then my hands are going to relax. I'm going to circle my hands around. My thumb and my fingertips are going to touch. Then I'm going to push my hands away, opening my shoulder blades, splitting them apart. And then relax. I'm Michelle Zemba. Tai Chi with me. I'll see you again soon. You guys did a great today. Sashian.